Let me show you how you can automate LinkedIn lead generation and outreach with HeyReach.io. HeyReach.io is a LinkedIn outreach platform that allows you to send cold outreach through multiple accounts and manage all of the replies in one place. It will also integrate with other tools in your outbound system and help you reach the full potential of LinkedIn's outreach. Now, it costs starts at $80 per month per sender account. So if you want more accounts, you can just add more of them for $60 a month. But you you basically have as many leads as you'd like as many LinkedIn actions as you'd like and if you want anything else you can up upgrade to an agency account basically so to begin just simply click start for free and you'll be asked to add your uh, information such as your first name and last name uh, your company uh, your email let's say we are using a burner email and a password right here's a password start our 14-day free trial and here's what you'll see when you log in into heyreach.io for the first time before we do anything we of course need to connect our LinkedIn accounts click link account and you can add your LinkedIn email address or LinkedIn password or connect it via Chrome extension so let's do that add to opera and once you install the chrome extension you'll be able you will be able to choose this option let's click it it's great my information all the all the data it needs the name profile picture and now you can select what kind of conversations it will track so of course we don't want it to see all the conversations we had in the past we only want to see the conversations that started by hayridge right so the conversations that hayridge reached out to the people it reached out to. so select that yes connect and that's it there you'll see your account connect if you want more accounts to send out more outreach messages you link more accounts if you need more seats you purchase more seats simple as that your account will have a couple of options to, so you can add account limits sending the schedule and most importantly you can add a proxy proxy will help you to wa walk around LinkedIn's limitations because if you're spamming all uh, outreach messages through hundreds of accounts from one IP address and and one place it's not gonna be good so you need to add proxy so on the LinkedIn's end, it looks like uh, it's different people, right? They're not sending everything from the same place. And adding a proxy is relatively, relatively simple. Once you purchase proxy from wherever, you just add a host port, uh, username and password, and, that, and that's it. Just like any other proxy, right? Managing account limits is also pretty uh, simple. As you can see, you just adjust how many follows you want, how many messages a day you want, email messages, right? Connection requests. Basically, if your account is warm, you can just go with the... Uh, the recommended settings if not lower it down and simple as that and schedule is of course just a schedule right you select when you want the actions to be completed right so perhaps you don't want to do on weekends you turn them off maybe for Thursday you want to start at 12 p.m. whatever it is you change your schedule based on this you change the time zone to be sending out in your prospects time zone and like that. And once you select the account, you'll be able to see all of the actions made by that account. So throughout all the campaigns, you're able to select uh, individual campaigns and see what this account has done, how is it doing, how many replies it got, how many connections it accepted, sent, basically all of that good stuff. So now let's head over to the leads tab and add more leads. As you can see, there are a couple of ways HeyReach can get leads for you. So for example, you can use the LinkedIn search bar uh, sales navigator which is a pre paid or a free trial of uh, LinkedIn you can use LinkedIn recruiter or LinkedIn group members right but I'm uh, pretty sure you need to be in a group for a couple of uh, days LinkedIn events LinkedIn posts the people that react to the post uh, import your own leads from a CSV uh, LinkedIn search bar or sales uh, navigator accounts so let's say we are doing LinkedIn search bar right continue and here you'll be able to list uh, the, this lead list for example first test select the accounts and then you need to add a search URL so let's do that so for example let's search for cold email let's see what uh, that will get us there's quite a bit of uh, results 141,000 that's plenty so let's just uh, copy the search go to hey reach add the search URL and start importing. Now HeyReach will go to that URL and scrape all the leads for you. Basically, I will, I'm eliminating any lead generation, manual lead generation that you would need, right? And if you can see, it already got plenty of information. Now it also has an option to find email addresses. This is if you want to integrate HeyReach with your other uh, email sending platforms like Salesforce to do some multi-channel outreach. And here you go, you have a bunch of leads. I stopped the scraping because this is just an example. But you 
you have a bunch of leads and a lot of information uh, scraped all for you, right? Without you needing to do anything. You, ha you have the headline, the job title, company they're working at, location, email address, uh, and LinkedIn URL. And you can use this to, of course, personalize the messages. Now we have the leads. As you can see, we have the first lead list we made, the first list. And now we can go ahead and create our first campaign. So go start new campaign, add your campaign name, Salesforce. Create, select the list that we just scraped or any list that you have, you uploaded or, or whatever lead you want to uh, reach out to. If you don't have any, uh, you can create an empty list. You can add an exclusion list. So this is like a do not contact list. So for example, people that you already messaged, as you can see here, the first connections, you can exclude a lot of people. So, so you're not reaching out to your customers, to your existing customers, to people you chat with, to people that are your competitors or people that are not really qualified to buy your services. Can you uh, continue? Select the account that you want to reach out with or, or multiple accounts click continue then you can edit your sequence and creating the sequence is pretty simple so you add an action so for example you first want to send a connection request right then you're able to write a connection request for example let's say hey first name how is it at uh, company right this is a very loose connection request right it's, it's not a great example but i'm just showing that there are custom variables you can use uh, you can add message variations to a b test connection request and then you can add a fallback message basically if ai doesn't get their uh, information like first name last name whatever you're using in the message for example here we're using first name, company name. If uh, the AI doesn't find that in your lead list, it will just use a simple fallback message that doesn't have any variables. So for example, hey, just uh, thought I'd connect with you. Of course, you don't want to use these simple connection request messages, right? You need to do some copywriting, think through, be unique and see what works for you best. Uh, but this is just an example, right? So if, if this fails, if you don't have any information about their company name or their first name, it will just use this message as a you know, fallback. Well, it is what it is. A save, and then you'll see that you have two options. For example, if it's still not accepted, the connection request, you can either end the automation or add another action. The same goes if the connection request is accepted. So you can adjust how many days you want to wait between those uh, actions and then add actions. So for example, let's say uh, if they do not accept our send request, we can like a post, right? Then a few days go by, we can, we can view the profile. Maybe we first should view the profile. And then if, if that doesn't happen, uh, we can resort to an email, right? So we add a subject line, uh, market research, research. You add your uh, message copy right here. For example, hey, first name, love your meme game at uh, company company's uh, Instagram, Instagram page, right? Uh, wondering if you, how you can automate meme creation. Let me know if I can send a video, right? And then again, uh, you can add variations and add a fallback message in case the AI doesn't see the variables, uh, like first name, company name, or whatever else you add, right? So fallback template, market re re research, hey boss, right? Whatever. This is just an example. But basically, you have this automation, and then if they do not respond, you can add more actions or, or ending, which is in this case, we're going to end. If they do respond, of course, it ends. You go over, you start chatting to the prospect. Now, if they do accept the uh, connection request, you can add a, uh, a way to send a message. Again, maybe the same message as an in-mail, in-mail test, right? And again, the same rules apply. You can A-B test the messages. Uh, you can add custom variables. And if those custom variables are not found, you can use a uh, fallback message message to send in case there's, there are no information. And basically this is how you can automate with if else statements, right? So send connection request, if it's still not accepted, like post, if it's accepted, you go ahead and do this, right? And once you build out your campaign, you can uh, of course continue and you'll be ready to launch your campaign. Simple as that. Scraping leads all automatically, reaching out all automatically, just handling the replies, all the positive replies that roll in after that, right? And when you're ready, simply launch a campaign and that's it, right? you'll be able to see how many leads it's going to uh, reach out to. So for example, we now have uh, 953 leads in sequence, meaning that the, the leads that you're currently reaching out to and uh, 
acting on, right? Then uh, pending leads, paused, failed, and finish, right? You have a couple of options to manage that campaign. You can pause the campaign. Uh, you can edit that campaign if you want uh, anything in it, or you can review the workflow itself, right? So uh, how it, is it doing uh, with the steps it's taking, uh, yada, yada, all of that good stuff, right? In the campaign in the campaign tab itself, you'll have an overview of all of your campaigns, how they're doing, how they're performing, how many leads they're reaching out to, what accounts you're using to reach out to. And whenever you get any replies, everything will be in one place. You don't need to go and log into multiple different LinkedIn accounts, have five phones, right? You see all the replies right in one place and here you can respond to your prospects. Basically ma making everything a lot easier to manage, reach out uh, and the book sales calls through LinkedIn without needing to look cross-eyed cross to five different screens, right? you managing five different accounts. No, you just use one prime box to see all of the replies for all of the accounts and reply on the based on those accounts. And in the dashboard tab, you'll see a huge overview of everything that's happening. So all the total of the uh, amount of the messages sent, messages throughout the exact account you'd like to see, throughout the, the campaign that you would like to see, basically an overview of everything that's happening with HeyReach.io, you know, the campaigns that you're, the active campaigns, how many messages you're sending, how many connection requests, how many replies you get, everything you'll see here and it's uh, an amazing place you can uh, sort by date of course campaign stats and everything now if you'd like to integrate something else you can simply go to integrations and integrate any platform that you're currently using now the thing with HeyReach is that it's only focusing on LinkedIn's outreach it generates leads from LinkedIn and reaches out to them now to get the best results I suggest you combine LinkedIn's outreach with email outreach and the best platform to automate cold email outreach has to be Salesforce it combines everything you can use the uh, other apps by Salesforce like Inforge or MailForge to basically automate the email infrastructure setup basically create creating a domains, email accounts, and Salesforce will help you warm up those accounts, automate all of the outreach, personalize the messages, as you can see the example here, and basically automate all the follow-ups and then just generate a lot, a lot of replies by following the best email sending practices. Now, I have a full uh, tutorial on how to use Salesforce and I'll link it at the top, but if you still do not want to do everything like manually, like setting up your sequences, adding uh, leads, I suggest you take a look Look at Agent Frank because Agent Frank is built to automate everything, right? It will automatically create domains and mailboxes, set up the whole infrastructure. It will go ahead and scrape leads for you, validate those leads, write personalized emails, and basically handle any replies or objections that you get. Basically, booking sales calls all on autopilot. I'll link it here as well. And if you have any questions, just let me know. Uh, let me know uh, down below. See ya.